Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today we're going to cover guys the symptoms of bad engine mount on pretty much any BMW guys. So if you have a bad engine mount, it's terrible guys and you need to replace it as soon as you can because you can cause quite a bit of damage to your BMW. Make sure to stay until the end and we're going to explain how guys and uh, it could, uh, you could run into problems that can cost you thousands of dollars to fix. So before we start, let me tell you a little bit about us guys. Uh, all the tools and parts that we use in our videos or if you need to buy a new engine mount, check out the link in the description of the video below and you can see where we get all the tools and parts from. Another thing, every single car we get at the shop, we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos, but specifically on any BMW that we get at the shop, we try to make close to 500 videos. Why we do that? Because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need guys in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, that way we can keep providing this free information to you. So, let me explain what we have and what are the symptoms of bad engine mount. Most BMWs guys, okay, except the newer ones, but if you have a rear wheel drive BMW or an all wheel drive BMW, in most cases, you will have two engine mounts, okay, one on the driver's side, one on the passenger side. If you have an engine that's facing this way for a front wheel drive BMW or even some all wheel drive, you will have engine mount on the left, you have transmission mount on the right and you will have some underneath as well. But 90% uh, of the BMWs will have two engine mounts, one on the left, one on the right. Those are the mounts, okay, they look kind of like that. Depending on the engine, the, the type of vehicle you have, how big the engine is and all that stuff, they may differ uh, a little bit. But uh, that's very important component, guys. That engine mount keep the engine in place. Also, it uh, eliminates vibrations from the engine. And as you can see, it consists of rubber. This is rubber that the engine lays on and catches vibrations. And here, most of them are uh, on even newer BMWs are filled with uh, oil. They're like hydraulic mounts. So. What that means, you have uh, kind of like oil here that catches the fine vibrations. That's why some BMWs run so smooth, guys, because those engine mounts are amazing design. So, when they fail, what do you expect? Number one, guys, you notice, you start noticing vibrations. Okay, you start noticing vibrations and at certain RPMs, you may notice them even more. Your uh, steering wheel dash will start vibrating, uh, engine you will feel vibration. Also guys, okay, uh, your engine will sound louder because that vibration will transfer to metal parts and those metal parts kind of like, uh, they when they vibrate they make a noise so it amplifies the sound of the engine. So uh, it sounds really bad, it's more like a loud engine, kind of like a little bit, uh, kind of like a metal rattling. So. This is because of a bad engine mount. But what else you can notice? You can notice, guys, uh, noise, okay, noise. And uh, uh, let's say w w when you're shifting gears or when you all of a sudden you give it gas, you let off the gas and then all of a sudden you give it gas again and you hear like a quunk, thumping sound from the engine, guys. Okay, kind of like the engine is moving, this is a bad mount. If the mount is broken, uh, or crack what will happen the engine will lift up when you give gas you just go up for a second then you will drop down that will create a noise guys so this is because of a bad engine mount and it could happen on both sides i recommend if one of them is bad replace the other one as well because probably you put enough stress on the other one and it's about to go as well now if you don't fix them on time they can break the rubber can break on the inside and the engine will move quite a bit up and down that moving will cause stress to cooling system components you can see everything how tight of a fit it is you can break cables you can break guys uh, uh, ac lines ac hoses you can cause quite a bit of damage let's say you break a coolant hose and you overheat the car you need a new engine thousands of dollars right there guys so if you suspect you have a bad mount fix it as soon as you can for your safety and for your vehicle safety guys thank you for watching and see you next time